serious questions. I like The Last Jedi, but was that movie even a sequel to The Force Awakens? Like, did Snoke matter at all? No. What happened to the Knights of Ren? Is that even a thing? No. Wasn't Kylo Ren obsessed with Darth Vader? No, not anymore. Where'd C-3PO's red arm go? <laughs> Why wasn't Poe hot for Finn anymore? That embrace was amazing. Oh my god, Finn, kiss his mouth. Didn't Luke leave his friends to go find the first Jedi temple? He could have at least told them why he was leaving, right? Come on, dude, leave a note on the fridge. Go away. If he just wanted a place to die, he could go literally anywhere or just die. Did the last Jedi break space combat? When Haldo accelerates to hyperspace through that Star Destroyer, why doesn't everyone do that? Why bother building a Death Star? If they do, just fire a bunch of hyperspace logs through it, right? Everyone loves a log. And have a droid flip the switch. She didn't need to go down with the ship, did she? More like all dope. See what I did there? Like Homer. How has no one ever thought to do this? Did they all sign a truce not to? Was this a war crime? A Star War crime. Probably because the resistance is broke. Hyperdrives ain't cheap, yo. Just sell some more Dakota rings. And on the other side, they found us. If the First Order can track the Resistance through hyperspace, why not make a jump to a safe distance, then another jump to right in front of them? Boom. Does this mean we're going to have to start thinking about other dumb, real science problems in Star Wars I don't actually care about? Like, why are there explosions in space? Or sounds? Or bombs that fall straight down? Does the fact that it all looks badass make everything okay? It does, doesn't it? If you want boring and accurate, watch Star Trek. What was up with that Maz Kanata video chat scene? Who's filming? Is she a vlogger now? Does she buy a GoPro droid with insurance money after her castle bar blew up? Streaming live on Twitch with Drake. What is happening? Union dispute, you do not want to hear about it. What's up with her shooting guns in some kind of union dispute? Is Maz Kanata a union-busting scab? Or is she shooting at her old employees because they asked for higher pay? Or is the First Order's First Order of Business cracking down on organized labor? Dude, they're not Republicans. Wait. Well, yeah, they're Republicans. Then in that same video call, she implies she had sex with the Codebreaker. Sounds like this Codebreaker fellow can do everything. Oh, uh, yes, he can. Really? How's that work? At a weird angle. She called Chewbacca her boyfriend, too. Where's my boyfriend? Chewie's working on the Falcon. Is Maz just being cheeky or, like, does she get down? How much alien species interbreeding happens in the Star Wars universe? Is it just Han and Chewie? Should I Google any of this? Probably not, right? Maz Kanati. All right, jumping and force ghosts and lightning. How many force powers are there now? I mean, that force projection thing that Luke does at the end? Really? Man, it's kind of a stretch. I mean, he seemed fine when Rey left, but because he used the force really hard, he died? So do all Jedi die if they use the force too hard? Is there a cautionary tale about lifting a certain number of rocks or you'll just keel over? Do or do not, because you might die. I mean, if you can force so hard that you die, does that mean like all the other Jedi from the movies were phoning it in? And sure, Ryan Johnson got that power out of a book that was published a long time ago, but does that mean that all the other force powers in that book are fair game? Because if so, are we gonna see a Jedi shrink to the size of an atom? And mannequin. Can Sith really kill people just by looking at them really hard? Actually, that does sound kind of cool. Okay, dude, either Johnson doesn't know the lore or he knows too much. Pick one. What does pork taste like? I could go for a pork chop. Yeah, okay, we're done here. Subscribe.